Hello everyone, welcome back to another video and today we're not playing Minecraft but we're going to be showing my Minecraft Lunar Client settings, uh, Premiere Pro settings and OBS settings because it's been requested for a little while, so consider the pack which I'll do for 2k. By the way, pack, uh, which is basically done, but we're going to be just doing this for 1.5 which uh, I'm 150 late, but I think this, I'll just do it now. So first of all, we're going to be doing Lunar Client settings, 41, and we're going to settings, 1.7 visuals, I have everything on 1.7, and my hit armor co color, it's this, and miss cooldown, I have show swinging particles, FPS, 1, show background, background height, this, this, I think this is regular settings, and I have it just placed right there. CPS I write on, I show CPS text, I have the white line color, everything's basically normal. Toggle sprint, I have toggle sprint, make sure fly boost is off, this can get you banned if you have it on. Keystrokes it's on, I have these things. Hypixel mods, auto tip, auto GG, level lead, all that. Coordinates, I have portion effects. All this, my custom crosshair, this has been requested for a while, it's this. Basically, uh, I don't use it because I like the Shane Crosshair, but these are the settings for my custom Crosshair if you liked it when I used to use it. Scoreboard, I have it on the left, as a lot of you would know. I check shadow on, border, background color. If you want it, if you want no background, make sure it's set at the lowest to that. Ping, regular, chat. This is my chat. Puddle multiply on two. In fact, I think it's better having it on three since you can see and miss people better if you hit them. Clock, this is my clock. Item physics. I just have item physics on. I don't actually, don't actually use it that much. A screenshot, but that's just default. Team, I'm not sure what that is. Just turn it off. Settings. These are my settings. I don't know much of them. I just have it on default stuff. Performance. Full bright. Shadow on. These are my other things. Controls. Mod menu is grave. Drop stack is you. Toggle chat. Don't have any. Hopefully, free look can be added back. And this is my preset. And obviously I'm going to look at my controls, these are 93, FOB is 93, fancy, maximum, 100, you can have this on fast, doesn't make a difference, maximum 100%, 16, unlimited, view bulbing off, VB is on, ordinary blocks, I normally have this off, doesn't make a big difference, maximum, trial linear, emissive textures off, this doesn't matter, all these doesn't matter that much, but I just have it on, this is all and everything is on, these are my detail settings, Shaders, internal, and FXA four times, and this doesn't really matter since it's internal shaders. Performance, fast render is off, obviously, smart animations is on, fast math, dynamic updates, that's all on. And controls, this is, I think, my other thing that people wanted. 56%, my DPI is 400. Attack, destroy button one, um, no hotkeys. Inventory is I, lunar client, that's just lunar client. Zoom is period, total perspective is delete. Full screen, it doesn't really matter. Jump is right control. Actually, I want to get rid of that. Let's change this to glass then. Jump is a right control. Yes, this is not, it's not space, it's right control. Sneak is right shift, left handed. Sprint is P, left, left arrow, arrow keys. And these, obviously, you don't want to really copy my controls since they're for left handed people. Chat settings. And this is in game settings. I'll now look at OBS settings and then Premiere Pro settings. So we are now in OBS. Obviously, I'm recording this. You go into settings, I've preview disabled, so it's supposed to help your FPS and stuff like that. This doesn't really matter that much. General, dark, theme. Yes, I don't use the light mode if it has something. Actually, I like this better. The light mode is better. Stream, you don't stream using OBS, you stream labs. Output. I can't, if I need, when I use advanced, it just doesn't work. So I'm just gonna, I always use simple. Encoders, NVENC, this is how the streaming work. NVENC, MP4, high quality, medium fire styles. I normally use indistinguishable quality, but I don't have that much space. And replay buffer, that's when you use, it's a handy tip, this is good for making montages since you just save clips. Um, I have this, microphone settings, doesn't matter that much. Push to talk, I don't use that. 1920 by 1080 length source fractional FPS value 240 by 1. This is how I get my 240 FPS and smooth recordings. This, I don't really use this. Process priority A is normal, and that is basically OBS settings. 
The final thing we'll be looking at is premium pro settings. So these are just my default. This this is default. And let this just load, and I'll give you an example of what I would use. So we're in premium pro settings. Control M. Obviously, you go into exporting, and this is exporting. H.264, obviously. Match or the, uh, this is just regular preset. And what I use is 1920 by 1080, 60 progressive. Doesn't it, it, 60 doesn't matter. Some people think you need to export in 240. 60 it just blends the frames down because it's important that you use flame bl frame blending, so it still has that smooth quality. Render at maximum depth. I have that on. Software encoding main 4.2. VBR one pass, you can use two pass, it just takes much longer. I would at max and maximum render quality use previews doesn't make that big of a difference. And frame blending, this is quite important. Audio AAC 48,000 stereo audio quality is high, obviously. Multiplexer MP4 standard, this is just all default. Don't you? And obviously, you output, you need to put your folder. And yeah, that's about it. That's four premium pro settings. And actually, I will just do fire, uh, not fire, um, streamlab settings and streaming settings are also fairly important. I have the Twitch Kittens Edge Cats theme. Mm. Theme? Mm. Theme. This is just, I just downloaded off the themes part and I have text there. Although that's not really what people care about. It's this stream connected to my remedial output advanced. I can put advanced for this, it works fine. NVENC new, CBR 6002 performance main, I don't know the best streaming settings, I'm not that good at streaming settings in general, so I don't really, you can in fact, I'm really showing this so you can in fact more so help me with my streaming settings, see what's better, tell me what's better, bilinear, common FPS value 60, 1920 by 1080, advanced, above normal, uh, just these are my hotkeys, doesn't matter how much notifications. I don't think this is a big deal, but that those are basically my streaming settings. And thank you for watching this video. And hopefully, my OBS settings, in-game settings, that can help you. If there's anything you want to tell me about streaming settings, since that's something I actually need help with, then please tell me. But aside from that, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy this long-awaited video. 2K special will be the sub. Will be the pack release. My next video is like. After this one, we'll be showcasing the new pack, and it's actually it's a really good pack. I'm really proud of how it came out. I've made some tweaks to it. It's actually made by Potion. If you're in my guild or my Discord server, you'll know who he is. He made most of the things in this pack. I'm, most of the textures are pretty unique. Uh, some are in other packs, but they're shaded differently. But that's pretty unique as well compared to my other one, which had a lot of other textures as well. So yep, this is just pack stuff and i hope you enjoy the settings thank you for watching if it helped you tell me in the comments and i will respond to you and if there's anything you can help me with in my stream labs and tell me that as well and i will take that feedback thank you for watching goodbye